Hey everyone, welcome back to pickleballbypros.com. My name is Riley Newman. And my name is Lindsay Newman. Now we are gonna show you how to properly warm up for any tournament or practice session you might have like a pro. Welcome to Pickleball by Pros, the world leader in digital pickleball instruction. So first, when you start warming up, you come onto the court and you start dinking straight ahead, right? That one's pretty common. A lot of us do that. If my opponents are not on the court yet, and this is a tournament, I'm gonna to practice some cross courts. I'm gonna practice on taking balls nice and early. If I can, out of the air, bring my paddle back up to a ready position. I wanna practice on shots that are gonna be in a, a normal doubles game scenario. So we'll do, we'll, do, we'll do this for a couple minutes, and then we would switch sides. We would go backhands cross court, and then we would go forehands cross court. We're gonna hit all of the shots that we would normally do in a normal doubles game. Moving the ball around, go some on the inside, go some on the middle. You wanna just get a good solid rhythm. Before we wanna start our match in doubles, we're gonna hit some volleys. These are called reflex volleys. We wanna go right at our partner, working on our hands. Because in doubles, this is a lot of pickleball. It's these, these volley wars. I'm focusing on making contact out front of me. There's no take back. And I'm simply just punching through the shot. Giving someone a high five. You're moving the ball around, forehands and backhands. Trying to take everything early. And then as you go, you can speed it up a little bit more. You can go a little harder. And harder. And get your sister like that. So now, once you worked your volleys, now one person is going to slinky back to the middle. Now, this is a key tip. A lot of people, when they warm up for their tournaments, they go from the kitchen line all the way back to the baseline, okay? But in normal doubles, we hit a lot of the shots in the middle court, so we gotta practice that. Don't skip ahead to the baseline. Go from your kitchen line back to your fifth shot drop. So now as we're going back, we're gonna practice our fifth shot drops. Pretend like you're dinking and you're just gonna reset the ball Give myself some height. This is very important when you're warming up. Got to practice these shots. This is a this is a shot you'll hit in the game all the time. Don't try to attack or hit hard in this area. Got to think soft. Gives you time to come up. Take balls out of the air. You would do that for a couple minutes. Now you're gonna work back to the baseline. Now you're gonna practice your third shot drop. Focus on, focusing on stopping, turning sideways, and hitting your shots. My target for this is pretty high. Remember, we are just warming up for a pickleball match. I wanna get a nice solid rhythm. So if I miss, I'm gonna miss high, that's okay. I will dial and find the range to get it just over the net. I wanna be hitting so it hopefully lands at my partner's feet. Once I hit some drops, now I'm gonna hit some drives. I'm gonna warm up my power shots. work my way back up to the kitchen and then now Lindsay would go okay you switch make sure Lindsay hits her drops and her baseline shots and then now 
I'm gonna hit some serves. So I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna practice my serve going cross court. Making sure I don't wanna be messing up. I wanna be making sure I'm a nice low to high. Give myself some height. I'm gonna step into my serve. I, my focusing on trying to get the ball deep into the court. That's all I'm worried about on my warm-up. It's just getting it nice and deep, finding that range. Okay? Then once I hit some serves, now I'm gonna hit my return of serve. We practice on going to the shot, going forward. Make sure, guys, when we're returning serve, that we're off of this baseline. We're giving ourselves some time. Now we're able to go to the ball, go to the shot. Remember, we don't want to be on this baseline because if a deep serve happens, so now we're on our heels and going back. So I always teach that we're off this baseline and now we're going to the shot. Off the baseline, I'm ready to it. Now, after return of serve, you basically warmed up everything. You did your dinks straight ahead. You did your dinks cross court, your fifth shot drop. Baseline, now it's time to lace them up and get you that win by pickleballbypros.com. Pickleball by Pros, where you learn from the world's best.